Hey, it's Chris here from the Content Marketing Academy. You may be wondering why I've got this big, bold title above me here and why the words that are coming out of my mouth are going along the bottom of the video here. Well, this is what we call a meme-style video. And in 2019, this is how we make our videos social-ready. We have been doing this this year and the view count and engagement and comments and likes and shares on our videos has absolutely exploded into tens of thousands of views. And we're a tiny little company speaking to a tiny little audience. We've had our own sort of viral element to our videos just by applying this style to our videos. So is it possible for you to take your videos and add this meme style template to your videos too. Of course it is, absolutely. And if you are doing video and you're doing social properly, then you will want to absolutely consider this for your videos to have more success because at the end of the day, more eyeballs on your videos, more views, more likes, more engagement in general on your videos is going to have a better chance of you getting the results that you're looking for from your video. So let's get into it, let's break it down. Now the first thing I wanna say is that this is a service that we buy, that we hire. We hire Ross Coverdale, Radlab, Radlad.co.uk to do this for us. So we film our videos, we send the videos off to Ross and he gets them social ready for us. He ratifies them for us, right? So he does all of this, puts them into the templates for us, edits it all up, puts the captions down here in the bottom, puts the titles in, puts them into Square, adds our brand. He does it in an IGTV version as well, which is a kind of portrait size, a YouTube version, gets all the captions ready, all of the stuff that we need to make our video social ready. And like I said, if you're doing video ready, this is a no-brainer. If you're planning on doing video, you absolutely should be thinking about how you get more success on social media with your video. So let's break down this meme style template. Why are we doing it? Well, we saw all the viral videos on social media, Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram. They're all the same. They're this square shape with a clickbait title above and the captions below. Why do they do all of these things? Let's, let's look at it, right? So we've got the clickbait title for one thing. There's a couple of things that this does. First of all, it lets your audience know that it's a brand new video. If you're like me and you have a background that's the same each time you publish a video, so we publish a video once a week like this, for example, people would think that maybe they've seen the video before, but with this big bold title up here, it means that they can see that it's a brand new video right away and they're probably going to want to watch it. Okay, so that's great having that big bold title there. The other great thing about the title is you can make it clickbaity. I wouldn't say you want to take it too far, but at least you can make it um, appealing for people to want to click, right? So ask a question maybe. Um, the other thing that the title overcomes is this issue with the post description as well. Sometimes people don't read the post description or it disappears, especially when your video has been shared into other people's timelines, it doesn't become so prominent. So we have to rely less on the post description to make our videos attractive and have these titles above to help us do that. So the title achieves quite a number of things and helps the video to be more shareable. The captions, absolutely crucial that we have the captions here. Now, most videos do have captions on them, but in most platforms you have to either, you have to toggle them on or off. We want to have as much control over how our content is seen on all the platforms. And one of the ways to do that is to do what's called baking them in. Right? Get the captions into the whole video file. So we've got the title, we've got the captions. This means that people can watch the video with the volume off for as long as they want to or as long as they need to until they figure out that the video is going to be worth their time to switch that sound on. If you're anything like me, I watch videos with the volume off all the time. So these captions allow that to happen. The fact that it's baked into all the one file, it means that when someone shares it into their feed, you have, mu you have as much control as you need over that file. The barriers are low, there's no effort required. You don't have to rely on the post description, you don't have to rely on people toggling the captions on and off, it's all there for people, so it's highly shareable. And that's absolutely key. The shareability is the power of these videos. Every time your video is shared, a whole bunch of new people are going to see your video that you've never, ever been in front of before. Absolutely crucial. That element, that shareability is so, so crucial. It's also a square shape, right? So it's a square shape, which is just the convention that we're used to now on social media. Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, squares, mobiles, mobile devices, 
tablets, even on the desktop, a square video works really, really well now. So we're following the conventions that we need to in order to make our videos more attractive to our audience. And the other final element is that normally when we're doing a video for YouTube or for Facebook or something like that, the thumbnail is our opportunity to have our brand in front of our audience. But the thumbnail is only there at the start or if it's frozen on the screen before we play it. Here we have the opportunity to put our brand in, as you can see at the top here and at the bottom, I've put the blue in here with the CME logo. Ross has done all of that for us, right? So our brand is there all the time. And the other benefit of that is that when our video pops up on people's news feeds, it's totally unique. Nobody else has our brand. So they're able to see that this is a CME video. They can see that it's a new video. They can watch it in silence if they want to. It's highly shareable. It ticks all the boxes. In 2019 and beyond, if we want to be doing video well, if we want to have success, if we want to make sure that we're meeting our targets and we're driving engagement through our video, then we absolutely have to, have, we have to look at what's already working on social media. Why are the meme style videos so popular? Why are the meme styles so viral, right? Where's that viral element come from? Well, a big part of it is about how the video is laid out and that's how we do it. And we're applying what we've learned from these viral meme style videos. We're applying it to our business videos now and it is working like a treat. Like I said, we're having tens of thousands of views on our videos, very small business, very small market segment, but it's absolutely working and driving engagement. It's fantastic. So, if you are doing video already, this is something that you can add very quickly into the mix. You send your videos over to Ross, over to radlad.co.uk, choose your packages that you want, send your video and Ross will get your videos social ready. Him and his team will put together this square version with your brand. You'll get an IGTV version, you'll get a YouTube version, everything that you need to be successful on social media with your videos. If you aren't already doing video, but you're planning to, then you're gonna to want to get this in from the start. It's a no-brainer. If you wanna be successful on social media with video, you absolutely have to make your videos as social ready as they need to be. It's absolutely worth it. So head over to radlad.co.uk, choose the package that suits you, get in touch with Ross and his team, send them your videos, get your videos social ready today. And I'm looking forward to seeing what the outcome is for you. Don't forget to be awesome.